neurotechnology uh, advancing to in the future? Say the next 10 years. I mean, the old 10 years is so hard, right? Yeah, like with, in, with, with AI, everything that's knows? happening. Yeah. And AI, and on, honestly, like last week, I was at a conference where uh, Microsoft presented their quantum chip, right? Oh, so right. for yeah. a geeky person like me, that was insane. Like they yeah. brought it, you know, and yeah. and it's it's beautiful, gold plated. But what's really interesting is they have a new um, a new material right. that is uh, stabilizing the qubit, and now they have a path to a million qubits per chip. Wow. Right. I used to be a chip designer. So for me, ah. it's, it's like extra like, oh, my God, this is so yeah. cool. Uh, I didn't know I would see that in my lifetime to see the new materials come in to be able to do this, this magnitude of computational power. Did they say so, how so long I guess that path is going to take? They said years instead of decades. Oh, wow. Years instead of decades. One of the things that was, was fascinating about that was they were talking about what does this allow us to do? So a lot of times people think, oh, we can do existing things faster. Yes, but bigger is um, we can solve problems we didn't even fathom asking.